Okay, it's getting close. The Maverick Surf Contest being watched closely by surfers and organizers alike in hope of those big waves because the window for the prestigious surf competition opened this week. Okay, so here we go. They're trying to retool the contest, though, after the near disaster last time around. NBC Bay Area's Joe Rosado Jr. shows us why the public will have to watch from afar. The thundering waves of Mavericks are the stuff of legend. Visitors from across the globe trek to this Half Moon Bay beach to witness one of the world's most famous surf spots. And I love pelicans. They look just like pterodactyls. But Lou Selitsky isn't just content watching the action. I'm an omnivore. Whatever gets in front of this lens, I will click. He's something of a beachcomber. Only his daily trips to Mavericks yield lots and lots of photos. We have herons, we have ravens, we have pelicans. It's just a, it's a target-rich environment for a photographer. And of course, Zalitsky's targets are often the surfers who ride the area's massive waves. It's tough here because they're so far out, but I do have my long reach lens. But Solitsky would need a really long lens to capture the action at this year's Mavericks Surf Contest. Hey, here we go. And though he'll have to keep his lens cap on the day of the contest, Solitsky isn't that bothered. So much easier, so much better, so much saner just to watch it on television. Joe Rosado Jr. You know, the day I leave my camera home is when I see the UFO piloted by Elvis. NBC Bay Area News. Ah, <laughs> oh, he's a Mavericks fan. <laughs>